Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I am going to be... I started off with an accent and then it kind of just went back to my normal... Whatever. So, welcome back to my channel. I am going to be playing your makeup today. I want to do like a Christmassy kind of look. So, <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. Um, well, I kind of have an idea, but... I just wanted to play in makeup and show you guys. So if you want to see what I come up with, then just keep on watching. So I'm going to start with my brows. I'm going to be using Anastasia Brow Wiz in Auburn because my hair is Auburn. <laughs> if you haven't seen my new hair color, then check out my latest video. I'll show you guys how I get it. Oh, oh yeah. Maybe I should zoom in a little bit. Oh yeah. Okay, on to my lids. I'm gonna use concealer. I think. Where's my concealer? Oh. I'm just gonna use some L'Oreal True Match Concealer to prime my lids. It is snowing outside, which means it's officially Christmas. It is Christmas and I am excited. Okay, so I'm gonna set my eyelids with some Laura Mercier Translucent Setting Powder. I'm gonna use this blending brush from Morphe, the M502. I didn't even get any eyeshadow. What? BRB, I need some eyeshadow. Okay, so I am gonna be using the Morphe 35K palette and just using some of the browns in here just to define my crease. So I'm gonna go in with that same Morphe M502 brush. <clears throat> Whoa. And I'm just going to define my crease a little bit. I'm going to use this color right here. So, this is what I have. It looks a lot more deep um, in person, but on camera it looks a little more toned down, but whatevs. So, I am going to be using some glitter. I'm going to be using the NYX Glitter Primer and the NYX Glitter in 06 Crystal. So, it's like a holographic glitter going to apply the glitter glue to my lids and I'm going to be using a Morphe M224 which is a flat <sighs> so I'm gonna just be honest when I apply this glitter my heart dropped like oh wow oh my god so i'm just going to put a little bit of this dark brown this one and it's snowing so hard and just kind of blend it in with the glitter This is, this is intense, okay? I love it though, like, I love it. And I'm just gonna do the same thing to the other eye. <laughs> I am a literally shocked. What? 
I am impressed. <laughs> Ooh, I'm gonna use the Wet n Wild Mega Liner. I haven't done a wing liner in so long, so wish me luck. I don't think I'm going to do a wing. I think I'm going to just do a line. Yes, I'm going to just do a line. And then just kind of blend it in with the shut. Ooh, I want to try that. Okay. I am impressed. Well, I am going to use some Lotus Lashes. This is a number 308. These are my old faves. I'm going to put these on because... I'm gonna put these lashes on because because they're really really wispy so you can still see like what's going on with the eyeshadow and they not overpower so I'm gonna do that so while my lashes are drying I'm just gonna take a makeup wipe and just clean up I didn't get a whole lot of fallout which is why I really really like the NYX glitter primer because you don't get glitter everywhere like it sticks. So while my lashes are drying I'm going to go ahead and start on my foundation. I'm going to be using the All Nighter Foundation by Urban Decay. Um, it is a full coverage matte finish oil free waterproof long wearing liquid foundation. Wow. I really really love this foundation like I haven't I think I'm using this in one of my videos. I used to use this all the time, right? This used to be my favorite. Like, I could not find anything that was more full coverage. I couldn't find anything that was, that stayed in place and didn't have my oil, sh oil shining through. So I'm gonna go back to that today. Actually, that's one of my favorite foundations. It's just, it's just that the colors are just, awkward so um it does oxidize so i would recommend trying it on wearing it for a few hours and then deciding your color um because what goes what it goes on as is going to be different than how it draws down hydrate my face with this repassage algo mist hydrating seaweed facial spray and i got this from my school I just like a lot of hydration when I'm going to be putting on a full coverage foundation and like oil free and matte, super matte. This color is 8. 8.0. That's what it looks like. Well, it oxidizes to my color. I think this was the color I used to use. Yeah. Look at that coverage. Like, <laughs> and that's not even all of it. Like, I still have a whole pump, a whole full pump left. So I am looking wow full coverage af for concealer i'm going to use the l'oreal true match and the color i have is in light medium in 4-5 and i'm going to let that just sit there for a little bit so i can blend out it gives it a little bit more of a fuller coverage um because this found it i mean this concealer is very like thin very lightweight um it gives it a fuller coverage so i let it sit there a little bit and yeah so i am currently mm, i've done my concealer i blended it out i have used the lara to set under my eyes now i'm going to set the rest of my face i'm going to use the urban decay naked skin ultra definition powder foundation in medium dark golden the m110 to powder do i ever feel like powder brings out your mustache like i have a mustache but i can't see it until i start putting on makeup wow that matches pretty good i'm going to bronze with studio fix uh studio fix powder in nc 55 with the same brush it's gonna make me look a little more golden because I, I feel a real pink right now wow that looks smooth mm. 
I'm going to finish my eyes. I'm going to go in with the Marc Jacobs Black Eyeliner. I don't know what it's called. Um, and I'm just going to do my lower, my waterline. Um, I'm going to put some extended play on my lower lashes. Mmm, yes. So, my favorite. I'm going to use the Liquid Glow in Bronze by Anastasia Beverly Hills, honey. I'm going to use my finger and like press it into the skin. Woo, honey. And you can stop here if you want to. Like, that's a really natural glow. Am I? Mm. So, I have contoured and I applied the Fenty Beauty Kilowatt Freestyle Highlighter Duo in Me Money in Hustler Baby. And I used Hustler Baby. It looks like this. This is mean money. This is Hustler Baby. And whoa. Mm. I am going to go ahead and do my lip. Oh, oh, I've contoured with NW55 Studio Fix Powder. Looks like this. And just a little bit. I didn't want to, you know, I didn't want to overdo it because my eyes are already doing a lot. So my lip, I'm going to do... Anastasia Beverly Hills American Doll a liquid lipstick. It's a classic red. It's a classic holiday look and I love the formula of Anastasia. So this is the finished look, okay? So this is the finished look. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. <laughs> I'm speechless. Like, lit. Um, all the products that I use will be listed in the description box below. Um, thanks so much for hanging out with me today. And I will see you guys in my next video. Comment below what you guys want to see next. And yeah. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel because you love me. <laughs>